2014, the November election season is here with Governor Corbett first to hit the airwaves. Eight on your side government reporter Pete Montine is firing up his fact check machine in this ad watch. We've got a great vision for Pennsylvania. Changing course from a taxi made on Tom Wolf in May, Tom Corbett is going positive in this ad, focusing on the state's economy during his first term. You can see where one struggling businesses now have new life. 178,000 new private sector jobs just in the last three years. We find with these numbers, there's more. Since Corbett took office in January 2011, state labor data says private sector jobs have grown by 178,000, but there are fewer public sector jobs. Factor that in, and that makes 126,000 new jobs overall. Corbett helped shed about 5,000 state workers. His campaign maintains private sector job growth is the best indicator of the state's economic health. That is part of what we're doing, is bringing people back to Pennsylvania. More than what the governor is saying here, it's important to pay attention to this graphic. It says Corbett's policies spur economic resurgence, and that needs context. The source here is a post on the Pennsylvania Manufacturers Association website. The pro-business group is not an unbiased news source like the graphic might lead you to believe. It's up to you to decide the headline's merit. I want to pass to the next generation a commonwealth that is debt-free, that is better than we found. That's the vision. This graphic here about natural gas drilling also needs context. It says PA has seen a surge in natural gas employment, citing a Federal Bureau of Labor Statistics report. Aid on your side obtained that report, showing natural gas job growth since 2007. But state data says natural gas jobs make up only 1% of the state's 5.8 million jobs, and the number of new hires has leveled off. Pete Mundine, on your side, News 8. Pete is preparing two more ad watches. Right now, he's researching claims made by a political action committee against Corbett. He's also checking the Corbett campaign's newest attack on Tom Wolf.